afternoon, everyone. The Gold Coast Student Guild and Cancer Council are really excited to have everyone here today um, to this great event. There are around 200 relay events in Australia every year, and I, I really think that we will have the best university students all across Australia here. Uh, I hope you're all ready for a great 18 hours to celebrate, remember, and fight back against cancer. You're making a huge difference, not just with your fundraising that you're doing, but you're here. If you look around and see all our cancer survivors and their carers, you're giving them hope. They know that they're not alone in this, that you've come along to give up your time, 18 hours, to walk and probably stay awake all night. But you've actually given them hope, that hope that we will have a cancer-free world. And that one day when students come to the university, part of the history lesson will be to find out what cancer is. For my best friend and I, hope was something that we never understood. At the age of five and six, we took on the world and beat cancer together. Growing older, we now realise that our story is obviously very, very unique and take moments quite often to realise the strain that was put on our friends, our family, our carers, the people around us. We now understand this concept of hope. So for me, really, Relay isn't about beating cancer. For me, it's about communities coming together and running and walking and skateboarding as someone was trying to teach me before. It's about being in purple shirts and in our case a lot of onesies and just basically for the hope that our efforts and hard work will in the long run help. It's about the hope that we can support families and friends and carers and it's about the hope that one day we can find a cure for cancer. Cancer can't take away my ability to love my three sons. Cancer can't take away my chance to show kindness to my family and friends. The opportunity to be a good example and to inspire others. My courage to keep going. To be grateful for the support in words and deeds. You know, treatment is tough, but I will be tougher. I will fight to live. So, we have so much to live for. We have so much to be thankful for. We can count the blessings and be at peace with our best effort. We can take each day as it is and live it. We will embrace this life while we have it. Thank you. The Relay for Life it might be the first time that it's on this campus, but it's been um, going worldwide for over 28 years. I understand that it's raised over a half of the, in that time raised over a half a billion US dollars, and today over 21 countries host this event. Relay for Life is a time for celebrating. It's a time for celebrating those that did survive. It's a time for celebrating those who cared for those that survived. And it's also a time for remembering. Remembering those that, unfortunately, can only be with us here in spirit today. And once again, I'd like to say thank you. Thank you for your support from all of you here today. Thank you. And at this point, I'd like to tell you guys that the 30, what do we have, 32 teams? 32 teams registered um, have raised, with the Student Guild donating $10,000 today to Relay for Life, $31,000. That's before you guys, uh, we still have to add up your final totals, so we're going to be over $31,000, and we'll let you guys all know uh, at Facebook in the future, but uh, congratulations. You guys have done such a great job fighting back against cancer, and I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart, and I can't wait to see this event grow next year, when all of you come back and you bring even more friends, and we have a, a great time all over again for 18 hours here. So thank you very much.